Do you experience joint aches that come and go? Or maybe it seems to move from one joint uh, ache and joint part to another part of your body. And you've gone to your doctors and they told you that nothing is wrong. That can be pretty frustrating to experience these uh, migrating joint aches and not really have a reason for it. However, it actually might be because of a buildup in the metabolites in your body. Now, what is really could be going on is metabolites are what your body creates when it breaks down substances, foods, toxins, drinks, medications, and supplements. When you're healthy, your body naturally detoxifies itself by breaking down these metabolites. But when you're unhealthy because of adrenal fatigue, this process can actually break down. The liver is actually your primary main detoxification organ system, and it works to really deactivate these metabolites so they're no longer harmful and they can actually be expelled. But when you have adrenal fatigue, the liver actually slows down to conserve energy because you need to conserve your energy to fight off the stress that you're encountering. So instead of deactivating and expelling the metabolites, it sometimes actually releases them back into the body when it's still active and able to do damage. And because these metabolites are so toxic, they can actually cause a lot of damage in your body. These metabolites circulate throughout your whole body through your extracellular matrix, which is the fluid filled spaces in between your cells, kind of like the scaffolding that's holding your cells together. And this causes your body's inflammation levels to increase. Now, the metabolites can be quite slow to move through your joints and through your muscles, irritating them and causing inflammation and stiffness. And if your joints and your muscles are already inflamed because of injuries, illness, or poor health, then you may experience a significant amount of stress, stiffness as well as aches when this occurs. So how can you tell if your joint aches are because of metabolites or because of other reasons? Well, if the cause is because of metabolites, then your aches will most likely migrate, which means it's moving throughout your whole body. One day you might experience it in your knee, then you might experience it in your shoulders, then in your neck, and then in your thighs, or just really all over. And you've also done further testing, which comes back negative, and that can be frustrating. The range of a pain is most likely dull, aching, but if it gradually gets worse, then it can be slightly severe. And again, lastly, it's not linked to any other disorder, illness, or injury. So once you've seen your doctor and eliminated other causes, it's time to consider adrenal fatigue and metabolite buildup as a cause. So that means you need to find a medical practitioner who can help guide you through this journey of adrenal fatigue and get your health back on the right track. Not only that is you have to find someone who's also well versed in helping to detox your body and clear out your metabolite buildup. However, this is not a one size fit all approach because every body is different. Every approach is also different depending on how sensitive your body is. From our experience as well, you know, some pay, some people we can go really, really fast uh, in detoxing their body. Some you can't even handle the detox, which means you need to go slower. There's also different modalities in helping to detox the body. So every person is different. Every body is different. Now, here are some of the excess metabolite production uh, issues that you might need to address. A poor diet, environmental toxins, excessive stress, low activity levels such as low exercise, certain medications and certain supplements as well. This is one of the big things that I actually see every day is supplements. Now, supplements are a big and often unacknowledged cause of metabolite buildup. Most people think that supplements are completely harmless and they take them without medical supervision, mixing them and matching them according to their needs, fashions, and whims. However, supplements can also be dangerous when they are used incorrectly. So even if the supplement is designed to help you, your body still needs to break it down, creating metabolites. And if you already have a high metabolite level, along with you have a poor liver and you have a congested extracellular matrix, then you might be making your situation worse, causing joint aches by taking supplements that are supposed to help you, but it actually makes you feel worse. Okay. This is even more true when your body is very, very sensitive, also because of adrenal fatigue, where you could be sensitive or overreact to supplements or react to supplements in an opposite way, which is intended as well.
So before you take supplements that are meant to reduce joint aches, make sure you consult with a doctor who's aware of adrenal fatigue, liver congestion, extracellular matrix, and liver as well. The last thing you want to do is create more metabolites, which will only make your condition worse as well as your aches worse as well. That's all we have today. So thank you for listening and we hope you got something helpful from really learning how to overcome joint aches. Remember that uh, we're here to empower you to take control of your health. And so if you'd like to hear more great tips, click the subscribe button as well. Please like and share this video so we're able to continue to make this content to really reach other people and help other people on their health journey.